Hey guys, this is DTJ here and I have a situation. So I was in the States for over a month, enjoying myself, seeing family and whatnot. But then I came back to Japan and my Tesla was dead. I mean dead, D-E-A-D, -E dead. To the point where it wouldn't even show up on the app. To make matters worse, I can't even charge it. Why? Well, because the charge port is stuck in a locked position and it won't receive the signal to open it up on its own or unlock so what do we do let's work this out I actually put in a ticket for this with the Tesla reps but they said it would take a few days for them to come out here and fix it and I needed the car the very next day for a family function it's tough being me but if you're ever in this situation do this step one get one of these jack adapters under the car and jack it up on the front left tire. In Japan it would be the passenger seat up front. I talked about these adapters in my other videos. You really need them if you're going to own one, a Tesla. Step two, take a flathead screwdriver and remove these tabs from the fender liner. You don't have to remove the ones closest to the door, just the ones at the top and closest to the headlights. Next, while wearing a mask, because it's gonna be dusty and nasty, peel back the liner and you have to stick your whole arm inside and feel for a velcro strap around the bumper area once you feel it it's the only thing in there that feels like velcro pull the strap down towards the ground not the headlights and while you're pulling down the front trunk will pop so now with your other hand push up on the trunk so it doesn't catch the latch congrats now you can reach the battery if you have a tow port in the front of your vehicle, then you'll be able to access a small cord that's tucked away inside that'll allow you to connect a 23A or a 9 volt battery. If that's the case, you won't have to raise your car, but you'll still need to access the battery once you pop the front trunk and charge the battery. Remove the top cover of the battery and put it on a charger. Push some max amps to it. So I actually went to Yellow Hat and I got this battery charger here. You can select 2 amps, 8 amps, or 12 amps. You can actually see the percentage that the battery is charged at as well. So I don't want to be here all day so I'm going to select 12 amps. So within minutes you'll be able to open the doors and unlock the charge port and charge the car. You may still need to replace your battery though. So if you want try driving it around to charge it up for an hour or so and if that doesn't work you'll likely need to replace it. Unfortunately it costs about 30,000 yen to replace with parts and labor. Thanks for watching. DT out.